How are you? I'm good. How about yourself? Oh, pretty good. Yeah, I'm just uh, enjoying our thriller. Your what? Our thriller. <laughs> the story, the saga. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Uh, yes. Being played like a yo-yo, <laughs> only walking the dog, according to Fleming. <laughs> a lot of ways that people depict it, it's pretty interesting. It is, it is. I just, yeah. I, sometimes I get amused, amused, but you know what, it's, it is what it is. And I, I believe that uh, there's enough people that are on the same track, it's just a, it's just to get to a certain point, yep, it's, it's ready, and then, oh, we got to do this, and, and, uh... Yeah, I think that there's a information, this information campaign that has to go on, and we get some of that. Uh, you know, but you step back and look at the bigger picture, like Fung said, and, and I think Bruce and others, you know, Mark C. argues this way, <laughs> it's got to happen before the election, and, and enough time for it to have an impact. So October 1st sounds like a good number, you know, all around. Yeah. And, you know, the reports about uh, the, the new money in place and uh, the arrests. Even Mark C. started talking about arrests and the political side, something he's been very quiet about. Well, here's, here's, here's a new one that I just got from Elena at 927, so about a half hour ago. And it's from Anonymous. USD money printer go brrrr. This week is going to be horrific for the markets up until Friday. Well, you know, the markets dropped, what, 500 points? On the, uh, yeah, they had a big drop today. Yeah. And then he says, I have inside info. Trump, along with Mnuchin, will announce this week that private banks are authorized to borrow from the Fed at negative rates just this one time and cut checks directly to Americans using a new payment system that is basically an app on your phone because the money is coming from the Fed using the private banks. There is no need for Congress to approve the stimulus. Now, that's a wow. novel idea. That's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. This week will bleed red for all markets due to major deflation from the stimulus being stuck in Congress. Trump will declare an emergency and make an in run around the congressional purse strings and print money using the private banking system. <laughs> That's a lot different than, you know, anything we've heard so far. Mm -hmm. He's going to use money from other agencies for the stimulus money. And, and, uh, and, you know, and if they are in charge of the Fed, uh, they can pretty much do what they want. The Fed's been doing what it wants, printing money and propping <laughs> up the market. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's quite, wow. quite creative, isn't well, it? Just, yeah, it's a very interesting story. And, and Trump it could is, be that uh, the, the people got wind of this, you know, at the upper level, and that's why there's been a lot of selling. Yeah, yeah, could be. Yeah, yeah I think it could be an omen now. And the last line, it says, Trump is cutting checks to everyone without Congress approval. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah, well, sure. I mean, this is part of the fight, tooth and nail. They don't want Trump to look good and get reelected, so they'll try and stop it. And but he's doing it anyhow. The counter move. He's doing it anyhow, and everybody's going to like him all the more. It'll pick up those extra people that didn't like him, and how can they not like him when they're getting checks? Because Congress won't. Yeah. Well, again, it comes down to, do you have a counter move? And he has one, apparently. Oh, yeah, he's a good um, chess player, remember? Now, here's the other thing. Now, Fleming is saying, and I think Bruce is too, that we're moving uh, uh, from uh, the Fed dollar to the gold-backed dollar. Yep, yep. I think 
Fleming was saying uh, it could happen here overnight where they finish it up. They were partway through giving it to 4X. Yep. I heard that about maybe the paymasters uh, being mm-hmm. a part of that, maybe from mm-hmm. Bruce. So, uh, you know, that could be kind of also at the, at the same moment, you know, using the Fed, you know, the negative interest rates just before, you know, tilting it in our favor, mm-hmm. just as we're tilting it back in our favor of gold. So it's only for, uh, let's say, a minute that Trump is doing this. Yeah, that's uh, all it A minute takes. before it flips everything, mm-hmm. you know, or it gets flipped. Yeah. Could be. <laughs> you know, and I mean, how are you saying, well, there was just one more little thing that they had to do and audit. And maybe they've been waiting for that to happen, and now now's the time for all this to start showing up. Mm-hmm. You know, mm-hmm. I mean, just kind of looking at things you know, the convergence kind of point of view. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Um, no matter what they do, the harder they try, the worse it gets them into. It's like they're burying themselves in quicksand. You know how it is? You see people in quicksand, the harder they fight, the deeper they go. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's true. That's true. <laughs> they, they really don't have much to hold on to. No, no, they don't. Uh, yeah. Hmm. yeah. And so I like the quicksand analogy metaphor. Uh, uh, well, and we're hearing about arrests going on. Uh, yep. I I was reading Judy's report. Uh, it comes from different places. <laughs> and, and, you know, about so many unsealed indictments and so many still sealed. And, and uh, you know, it's large, huge numbers. So that's starting to break. And as you mentioned last night, Biden, the Ukrainian connection. You know, it's like things are ready to, to rock and roll here. You know, and you think it could happen tomorrow, you know, to next week. And you know, on. You know, it depends on how fast things roll, what order. <laughs> of course, you know, mm. history. This, this, is, uh, this is getting to be fun. Watching this, you know that, and then and then they're going to put in the uh, Supreme Court the new uh, justice, uh, and then and then yeah. um, that's going to go real easy and fast and. Mhm. Yeah, it's all about the Senate. We have the Senate. Oh my goodness! That, that's who confirms so. So. Mm-mm-mm. That's that's really something. Yeah. Well, everything's kind of going our way. I mean, especially with this new report, you know, if it's true, and I, yep. I, I you know, I believe it so far. We'll, we'll see. You no, know, I, I don't mind if I'm wrong, if I, but I do believe it. It, it could be done that way. Mm. Uh, yeah, so, uh, you know, and the closer you get to election time, too, the harder it is for the Democrats to counter, too. Yep, yep. Well, you know, the uh, more are people... we going to have blockchain voting? Are we going to really have a vote? Or are we going to have Jacinta announced on the first, and everything changes? And everything changes. Yep. Well, it, that's a big question. It's yeah. it's got to happen if if we go to the gold standard and it's global. It's uh, you know we're headed that way yeah. with negative interest rates, and then everybody gets their checks, and then all of a sudden, that's the beginning of a pour out of you know to the to the uh, debt forgiveness, and it's a drip, 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 and it's like we were saying yesterday, it's once that momentum gets going, it just, it, it compounds itself, and mm-hmm. and mm-hmm. next thing you know, they're, um, they're hanging on to air to try to save themselves, and it's letting them down. Uh-huh. Just like the dollar, the fiat dollar is just made out of thin air. Nothing to grip onto. Well, that's it. You know, and the companies really aren't growing economically, mm-hmm. and that's that's the key mm-hmm. about the markets. It's all propped up by funny money. So, yes, 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 yes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, hmm. Let's see. Um, 
Well, well, Fulford, you know, he always has lots of things to say, and you're not too sure whether how true a lot of it is. But he did say that uh, they're making moves in Switzerland going after, uh, you know, I suppose, money laundering and the yeah. pedophilia and whatnot. Like, they're moving from Israel to Switzerland, I think is what he was suggesting. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Not that interesting. <laughs> Uh, not that I really have any any good grasp on any of that stuff. You know, that's all kind of new. Um, well, you know, all of our money pouring out uh, into the economy, and we're, you know, by February when they probably come out with a report, you know, things should be looking great. Uh, well, okay, let's go back a little bit here. October 17th, JFK, coming out party. Uh, you know, I, I I like your line of thinking about how things roll out, the success plan, really. And, mm-hmm. you know, call it a succession, you know, if you bring in JFK in, into the picture. <laughs> uh, it's just a, just a really good fit. I mean... You know, someone else could have thought of that too, right? Long time ago. Oh, yes. How are we going to How are we going to make all this work? Yeah. I mean, you're just kind of seeing pieces coming together, you know, to suggest that this would work. I, I think you got, you know, you found the right fit. <laughs> yeah. Just amazing. Well, you know, the whole thing about holding off everything, uranium two or Biden and the pedophilia, and uh, it, it, it'll be the undoing of the press because they've been complicit in covering everything up. Oh, my. I, I read something where Trump said something outrageous and no and followed up in the press with a question about pedophilia, I think, or something, you know, huge. I saw that in the Restored Republic uh, a little while ago. Uh, There's an awful lot going on. (laughs) Now, Bruce mentioned that uh, they're having meetings every about every 12 hours in the White House over over the the currency reset. Reset. Yep. 11 o'clock, midnight, 11 a.m., 12 12 a.m. That's pretty much Trump's hours anyhow, so. Oh, uh, uh-huh. Uh, by yeah. the way, did, I was going to ask you, did you hear TNT by any chance today? No, I didn't. Yeah, and I'm, I'm trying to, it, it's it's not loading. Um, the, I, I'm in a meeting all morning. I don't get done till about 12. Um, so I'm, uh, uh-huh. all day, all well, I this just week, heard, so. uh, and we're looking at, some of the highlights and recaps that they're supposed to come out uh, Thursday. Does that mean Wednesday already? I keep hearing that. I hear that too. Bruce said that. No, and I, I think you know all this is being played for the <clears throat> for the right timing, and and they're being you know kind of led along like the rest of us to a certain extent. Yeah, they know their part. That's how I look at it. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, so, that's right. you know, but, but those are the kind of things that make you go, uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh, yeah. You know, and you look at enough of those across the horizon, and you say, I think we're just about there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, I mean, those, yeah, on a, you know, at another level, you know, geopolitical. Mm-hmm. Yep. And... And they have to pay their people, and they're running out of money or dollars. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Hmm. So, uh, yeah, and, you know, and I imagine they're, they're keeping everyone guessing, and they're listening to everyone, trying to figure out what their plans are, and, mm-hmm. and try and get there ahead of them. Well, by the way, the Q drops today are just... Uh, I was going to count them oh. to see how many there are, but there is a lot. That just, oh, I didn't know. Yeah, yeah. There's um, 
I'm, um, there hasn't been anything in the last two hours, but I'm, I'm just going to go out here and count them. See, today's the 23rd, right? All day. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Thirteen Q drops, and they've all been this afternoon. Well, the other news I just remembered is really in Europe where they've closed the banks uh, in a lot of countries. Two, two weeks it's been now, uh, according to Germany Ward. for a week or two. Two weeks, yep, according to... Uh, and they're transitioning. Ward. Yes, yes, all over Europe. Spain, yeah. Italy, the England, Germany, France. I didn't, they didn't name any of but those, I mean, what else? Those are the big ones, and if they're closed, you know the others are. Oh, and, and by the way, the, um, I don't know where I heard it, but the reason all the coins have been turned in is they're re, uh, circ they're re, what do you call it? Um, they're smelting the silver out. Yeah, they're oh, pure silver them. for the silver coins, is yeah. what Bruce is saying. Yeah, that's right. Not that's nickel, right. and he's not too sure about the penny. Right, right. You yeah, notice, I figured that was happening, you know, with, uh, with the coins, I think it's just in general, you know, a new coin. Yeah. You notice how I got it out? I had to get it out through YouTube. <laughs> oh, yeah. I worked and worked yeah. and worked. So, anyhow, I'm going to keep the call short tonight. If I get too long, then it makes it more difficult. To... Oh, sure. Yeah, that yeah. was a long call. I had no idea we went that long, but there was a lot to talk about. <laughs> oh, boy, there's probably a lot to talk about tonight, but I think I'll, I think I'll call yeah. it quits. Yeah, we'll listen to Bruce tomorrow, perhaps, perhaps, yep. and yep. Uh, take it from there. Yep, you bet. Okay. Okay, my friend. All right. Have a good night, Dad. Yeah, you too. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Uh,